Hello, boys and girls, my name is Otacy, and welcome back to Season 2 of Another Day in Minecraft. I already did uh, Episode 0, uh, where I uh, gave you a bit of uh, instruction on what this uh, season is all about, because uh, uh, while I can break blocks uh, or leaves, I can't break blocks or I set myself the challenge to not uh, do that so that makes things a tiny bit difficult as uh, we have to uh, work around the fact that I cannot break any blocks to get resources and uh, of course, there are various ways uh, to do that, but here in the beginning, I am thinking uh, creeper explosions uh, on the side of trees uh, or uh, stone walls to get ourselves um, a bit of uh, the needed resources. So, and for that, of course, I need it to become night. So, uh, that's when the uh, action starts. And uh, what you can do until then is uh, head down in the comment section and put your guess down how many times I will die until the uh, end of the episode. This uh, uh, first few episodes will probably be uh, uh, more like uh, not that uh, uh, focused on any projects, just getting started, so uh, very survival adventure like uh, with uh, many cuts, so I can uh, bring to you the most interesting uh, things uh, that did happen here while trying to get a start. So uh, as mentioned you can head over to the uh, introduction uh, video for more details. Uh, most of it is also down in the description. And as you can already see, I can break the, the leaf blocks. And that's mainly because leaf blocks um, we cannot obtain uh, in any other form uh, than uh, silk touching. And uh, if you want to uh, uh, have nice uh, builds, uh, leaf blocks are somewhat essential. To uh, uh, give uh, the, the the whole thing a bit of uh, atmosphere. So here uh, at spawn, I will clean out a few of these uh, leaves off the trees, and then when it gets night, I hope we get. Uh, lot of creeper action going and uh, not so many other mobs. I'm playing this on on hard mode this time right from the start. In the first series I did switch mid season from from normal to hard uh, because certain farms only worked on hard mode. But yeah, I guess I will do a bit more uh, de-leaving uh, until uh, it gets night time and then we will hopefully uh, get a bit of creep reaction for some locks. As it gets night time, I moved a bit off from the actual spawn point because uh, if we die, the, the place we die, 
that will probably spawn with mobs and uh, basically having them spawn actually where we're or uh, having the mobs right at spawn um, that's a bad recipe for survival that's more something like a death loop the best thing you can then do is uh, um, wait for morning uh, then at least the zombies and the skeletons should burn up as a large uh, part of the, the spawn area is now deleaved so there's nothing for them to hide under now let's find a um, creeper that can blow us up this here is the, is the spawn area as you can clearly see by the lack of, uh, of leaves and the first death we should probably be uh, weary of um, of uh, uh, the the zombies because if we hurt them they can spawn in reinforcements is not good there is a creeper yes our first wood block oh, there is another creeper more uh, that's more but that's also another death creeper creeper more blocks Maybe the safe thing here is to wait near uh, dawn time, which is still a bit away, and then maybe uh, go around, try to uh, to catch um, a few uh, a few creepers. Okay, looks like the sun is coming up again. There is another creeper, but there's also a baby zombie down there. All right. And if we wait for the sun, they should burn. And here you can already see part of the problem. Uh, I sometimes need to place blocks to make some uh, some progress here. Um, but uh, if I would not be able to mine those back, um, could be a very ugly uh, landscape uh, after a, a short time. So uh, I think now it's time to see where we are at. 
if one of these skeletons would drop a bow, that would be great. And low health. So what we need here is crafting bench. And then oh yeah, can remove all my dirt pillows here then probably let's put the crafting bench up there that should be safe from creepers then we will create a chest um, there on the side and basically put everything save the dirt blocks in there and then I need a bit of food so maybe let's go for a bit of fishing and with the with the chest there Ooh. With the chest there, I can place item in there um, before potentially dying. Uh, and thereby I can accumulate um, goods or items or blocks. It's getting dark again, so um, while I'm pretty low on health, um, I also got a few things while punching leaves. So uh, put that in the chest so it, they are safe. And then we will wait for more uh, mobs to spawn yes hi okay second hole right beside the first one I think I will stay here on top of this tree until the morning. All right, then let's see if we can make use of the sun here. There's another creeper. We will make use of this one as well. Nice. No locks. And another day is dawning. Uh, but as you might hear below me, there are uh, one skeleton and at least. Ooh, a drowned and two zombies, I think. So I will try get away here. And we got two locks. 
Have you left your guess for how many deaths I will die in this episode down below in the comments? If not, I have a hint for you. The number of deaths that you have seen so far is not even half of the numbers I died. And uh, looking in here, I managed to get one stack of uh, oak clocks. Uh, a few birch and then some. Uh, also did a bit of uh, uh, fishing, we can do more and I think what I want to achieve still in this episode is also have one stack of cobble. Um, currently the landscape uh, looks um, Pretty wasted with holes everywhere, but you can see there are places uh, where um, I actually have a problem now because I cannot get out. Um, yeah, I'm stuck here until something comes along and kills me, but um, we need to uh, get a few of these uh, couple blocks and uh, at a few places the uh, dirt on top is already uh, gone. Um, so it should not be too much of a hassle and probably on the way we can get a few more locks. As you can see I had to expand to two double chests uh, mainly because so much dirt. Also got a bit of the rare blocks, uh, we got some flint, some gravel, uh, gunpowder. Uh, also one ender pearl, one grass block. Then we have about two stacks of wood in here, one stack cobble in here, and then uh, almost two uh, stacks in here. Uh, but if you look at this landscape, it's pretty riddled with hole, and I think. Um, the amount of wood is not nearly enough to get us uh, started decently. Uh, also probably need a bit more uh, cobblestone. Uh, but I guess until next time I will be uh, farming more wood. It's a bit difficult as the uh, creeper, if they explode right next to the trunk, uh, they drop at most two to three uh, wood blocks, uh, so it's quite tedious. But now also let's have a look at the uh, statistics. Uh, maybe this one first, uh, blocks broken, um, we see okay quite a few uh, dirt blocks, uh, but I placed uh, way more than the ones that I have uh, broken. And if we go here in the general uh, section um, uh, on the where would I find the kills? Number of deaths. 255, uh, so that's quite high. Uh, if you were uh, close to that number, congratulations. And uh, with that, uh, we are actually at the end of this first episode of this a bit different season. I uh, hope you enjoy this and join me next time when we will try to get more uh, blocks without mining.
until then goodbye